All right, I'm gonna do a quick video on how to bend vac press shells without a strip heater. And uh, I'm doing it for, I don't know, God, six months now, so I think I've gotten pretty good at it. Uh, what you'll need to do is cut all, uh, drill all your holes, clean them all up like you want to, right? Again. And then um, you wanna cut the top. I don't really care about the bottom because I'm gonna fold it over and do it in the uh, scroll. So I'm going to cut the top, that way when we fold it, the uh, magazine obviously has room. You don't have to have a bullet in it because it's already, you know, designed for that. So what I have is you're going to get your clamps ready, get your MRD out, and then we got our DeWalt heat gun with the slot guy on it. So. I won't do it from this end, but heat them up on the inside, that way the heat doesn't get trapped here. And what I'll do is I'll take the MRD and place it in where it's supposed to go. Right. Then, just keep it moving in the middle. It's getting pliable. Then fold it over. Clamp. Throw your magazine in it. And then put it. I put it in there just so it, uh, the sight channel tool, just to see. But that's what it's going to look like. And I'll, I'll pretty much hold it because my, my sight channel tool does not go that small. That way we get that good bump. And magazines good in and out either way. There's tape on it, so obviously it's a little iffy. But that's it. So there's one. I let that cool. We'll do it again. I pretty much just pulled it. And you get a good sight channel. Well, it's not a sight channel, but you get the good bend. And as well shut this off. Never shut off a heat gun while it's hot. You want it to uh, cool down. So there's one. And there's two. Then I'll go ahead and trim them. And uh, that's all she wrote. Enjoy.